Okay guys, for this project, uh, I'm using Arduino Nano 33 IoT because uh, its um, flash memory size is bigger, okay, if you want than Arduino Nano. So my OLED screen to uh, four pins, okay, uh, no reset pin here then uh, that's my RGB LED module for pins as well then I have uh, three tiny push buttons okay uh, for left right and uh, select okay now we start the build let me just connect my Arduino Nano 33 IoT board on the uh, breadboard. Just like that, just like that, just like that, like that, like that. Like that. Okay. Let me uh, fix the pins because we gotta fix the pins. Alright. Uh, if you don't fix the pins, we we won't be able to connect onto the breadboard. Now I think it will. It should do. Uh, just a little bit of patience. Okay, it's working. Yeah, it's working. Okay. Um. Well. I'm going to show you the schematic, okay, guys. But uh, I'm going to use the uh, RGB LED module. The red LED is attached to pin five, uh, green pin uh, three, and um, and uh, blue pin four, okay, guys. Um, so uh, I, I use pin uh, five, three, and four. Okay. Uh, now um, let me connect the uh, OLED screen to display the uh, information. Okay. But let me connect first. Uh, uh, let me take remove now let me connect okay so I, uh, I'm using input pull up okay guys so I just need to connect one of the uh, pins of the push button to, to ground okay and the, the other to the uh, data pin okay okay that's the ground okay input pull up uh, so the first pin is attached to i mean the first uh, led i mean push button is going to pin two uh, the third one to pin six okay this pin six okay guys this is the third uh, push button now in the middle okay is going to pin uh, pin seven okay um, um uh, now we can uh, uh, set up the uh, OLED screen okay guys so as I said okay uh, uh, in the beginning of, of this video uh, I'm using Arduino Nano 33 IoT because its flash memory size is good um, with uh, Arduino Nano is very complicated okay so as I said in the uh, uh, schematic you can use Arduino Nano 33 IoT for this code okay guys because this code uh, occupies um, uh, a lot of spaces or if you want space spaces okay so the code is well 
he explained okay and uh, I'm going to provide uh, in the d description of this video so if you want to use Arduino Nano 3.3 IoT you need to to download okay the board okay Arduino SAMD okay this one you need to install this one then you go to tools and uh, yeah you can choose your board from here you can choose the pin uh, everything we go uh, will be good okay um, now testing time we're gonna test the code okay so guys thank you so much and uh, don't forget to subscribe okay okay and uh, hit the uh, bell icon i see you in the next move